My name is Susan Roderick. I'm a videographer, photographer, and editor. Okay, now we have our voiceover and we have our technical edit finished. And I'm just gonna show you some creative things that you can do to add to the edit. So first we're gonna add music. iMovie does have music. Um, here's the audio and there's theme music, sound effects, recordings, playlists, albums, artists, and songs. So we'll just go into theme music. We're gonna use the bright song. And while I'm doing that, let me just show you the themes. If you click this little settings button down here in the bottom right hand corner, that will take you to your different themes. So you see that they give you some options, bright, modern, travel, etc. So we're just going to choose the bright theme as well. We'll turn the theme music on there. We also can start the video by fading in from black and fading out to black. I use that because I think it looks cool. So now we have the music and let me just show you a couple other different options that we can do. So you need to select a clip to get these options. And you'll see at the bottom, you can change the speed of them. The turtle is more slow-mo and the rabbit will make this, will make the clip go more quickly. All right, let's go to another clip. Show you another trick. Here is text, so you can add any sort of text to this clip. I'm just gonna kind of do a standard one here and select on the, t the text. And let's see here. I'm just going to say Kelly, just so you can kind of see that there. All right, so we have the Kelly text. Let me delete this one. They give you a lot of uh, text options, so I'm going to delete those. All right, so that's just going to say Kelly on that. Um, another option you can do is add filters. Filters are really fun. Filters are down here, this little icon here with the three circles. When you click that, you'll see that you have different filters. You can change the coloring. Um, we'll just do a couple different filters so I can show you what they are. Here's a blue filter. Let's do Duotone, just so you can see that you can change this up if you like. Um, another thing that you can add is transitions in between each clip. And that just makes the video more smooth, run more smoothly, so it won't be, you know, cut up. So let's just add a dissolve transition, and then we'll go between two more, and we'll add the wipe transition, and then we'll do another one, and we'll just add the fade transition. So now we've added transitions, we've added our theme, we've added fade in and out. All right, we've added music. Let's see, what else can we add? We've uh, sped up or slowed down the clip. This is just audio, you can turn that up or down. All right, so I think we're ready to go ahead and play this now and just to show you a few of the different creative options that you have. So we'll take it from the top. Now we have our voiceover, we have music, we have a few of our, uh, uh, one that has text on it, we have some transitions, we put in a theme, and we also have put in some filters. Hi, my name is Kelly and I'm a DIY designer. Three things I love are photography, yoga, and cooking. I love photography because it allows me to record my memories. I enjoy yoga because it relaxes me. I spend my time cooking because it tastes so good. I'm inspired by creativity because it makes me feel alive.